Hi everyone, I'm here with Jean-Francois Odic. Jean-Francois is the specialist of water here in Oroville and um, because the question came in one of the courses about what is the importance of the pH of water for health, I said like the best man to ask is Jean-Francois Odic and so I will uh, let him explain uh, what he thinks about this subject. Okay, yeah, the scientists are not, uh, they, they don't agree on uh, the optimum pH of the water. Uh, for health, especially anti-cancer, they advise uh, an alkaline water, uh, 7 to 7, 3, up to 7, 5 is uh, advisable. So that this is most uh, uh, agreed uh, consensus. Now, um, we have also some scientists in France, like uh, the bioelectronic of Louis uh, Claude Vincent. Uh, they, they are talking about acid water. So 7.5, 7.6, something, 7.8. It's, it's also used in France. Uh, acid, you mean that 6.5? 6.5, 6.6, right. Yeah. Uh, usually, we have to use the reverse osmosis in, uh, in India, especially in Tamil Nadu, because of the, the water intrusion, sea water intrusion. So we have uh, brackish water coming inland. So in, 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 in Pondicherry, for example, we have now up to uh, 1,000 ppm of salt in the water. So reverse osmosis is necessary. And reverse osmosis is bringing down the pH below 6. So you have to find a way. And Vortex is a good way to optimize and increase the pH. Uh, when we have optimum conditions, we have a pH here between 7.2 and 7.3, slightly alkaline, which is good. Okay. Which is good. Which is the best. Uh, so the vortex is uh, creating um, what we call um, a complete water. The vortex is a concentrator of prana, concentrator of ether. And um, it's what uh, the philosophers of the past called the water of above, meeting the water of below. And this is energetic water. So that's what the, the vortex is doing. It's getting um, Prana, ether, the fifth element in uh, in the water, and in doing so, energizing the water. Okay. So that's why. It is. And that's why, for example, in our countries in Europe, for example, we, we don't have the problem of needing reverse osmosis. If water comes out of the ground as yes. a source, yes, then it will be naturally already having that vortex energy. No, no, we have to. No, we have to still have to produce it. Give that extra energy. Exactly. Okay. 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 Thank you very much. You're <laughs>